right now, um, we live in McKinney, Texas. Um, I live in the historic district, uh, so a small part of the town. Um, uh, I have a wife and I have five kids. Um, my oldest is venturing off to the Air Force soon to be a firefighter in the Air Force. Um, so we are going to come up here. We want to come back to a small town, um, get out of the bigger city. Um, this felt like a good fit. Um, there's a gentleman who grew up here who I knew, and he raved about it when I called about him. Called him about the job. You know, he encouraged me to apply for it. Uh, he's Tom Harvey. He's currently the fire chief down in Princeton. When I grew up as a kid, I used to go to the local fire station, hang out. They used to fill up my bike tires, register our bikes back then. Um, and it was a job I always thought I wanted to do. Um, so I ventured off into the Marine Corps, and after I got out of the Marine Corps, um, I set out to get a fire job somewhere. Um, and it led me down to the Houston area, um, where I decided I wanted to go to school and do it. Well, I got five kids, so they keep me pretty busy. Um, I like to go watch their sporting events and hang with the kids, play with the kids. Uh, the wife and I like to go to the parks and hike out in the, out in the parks and stuff like that. Um, outdoors kind of stuff. When I was a kid, it's something I've always dreamt about, always thought I would I would do. Um, when I got out of high school, again, like I said, I, I went off into the Marine Corps and I really didn't know what I'd do after that. Um, I started applying for jobs um, and actually, when I got to Houston, I applied for the Houston Fire Department and or went to apply for the Houston Fire Department and they told me that you already had to be certified and I, I was like, we didn't certify. And uh, so I did a little educate, uh, educational research and figured out you could actually go to college and become a fireman. So that's where I ventured off into paramedic school and fire school. Helping people. Uh, that's the, the, the brotherhood, the camaraderie, uh, the friendships that you, you make. Um, it's a job where you can get out into the public and uh, help people who are in need. I've been involved in fire rescue since 1993. I started off as a volunteer, um, did that for about three years whilst I went through school, and then I took my first paid job in Woodlands, Texas, which is a smaller city, uh, three fire stations at the time. Um, I worked there for a few years, and then I moved up to the Metroplex and took a job in Arlington, Texas, uh, where I just retired from. My greatest strength would be um, I'm a people's person. Um, I'm a great listener. Um, I'm a doer. Um, I have a deep care for people. I'm not a computer genius, would be my greatest weakness. Um, I, I manage and I'm fairly confident in it. Um, first off, I'm just going to evaluate and see what we got. Um, I hope to uh, enhance the fire department, uh, make it a better place to work. Um, work on the retention of the firefighters here, make it a great place to work, make them not want to leave, um, and, uh, and maybe enhance the uh, fire and EMS side of things for the citizens whilst we're here. And work, work, work together with the EMS side and uh, forge a good relationship there and make it a, just a better and stronger uh, uh, community. Oh, I think it's great. I've got to meet uh, most of the B shift I met. I'm um, starting to meet C shift. Um, uh, my assistant chief, I've been in contact with him an awful lot uh, here and uh, discussing it. So, uh, super excited. Um, seems to be a great, great group of guys, and I look forward to serving as their fire chief. My name is Mike Vogel, and this is my story.